Hello everyone, this is a lesson on scales and then we are gonna, we were going to use two examples to explain how we work with scales and maps. So the first example says a map is drawn with a scale of 1 is to 20,000. So this scale, uh, it will compare meters, centimeters, but whatever you have, one of it will, will be equal to 20,000 of the other one. Uh, this is one on the map. This is 20,000 on the ground. If the real distance between the two points on this map is 600 meters apart, how far apart in centimeters would they be on the map so the first part that you need to do is to convert the meters between the map and the ground before you are worried about converting to centimeters let us do the first part okay i want you to notice something they're saying here the real distance you are given the real distance you we want to calculate how far apart will it be on the map? So when you are given the real distance, 600 meters, you are going to divide with the scale to get the map. When you are given real distance to convert it to map, you divide. When you are given map converted to real descent, you multiply. So let's divide that and see. Let's use our calculator. 600 divided by 20,000. We get 0, 0,03 and my unit is meters. So on the map, it will be 0, 0,03 meters. I need to convert this to be in centimeters because that's what I'm asked. They are asking how far apart in the map would it be in centimeters. So I need to convert that to centimeters. Let's do that. Right. Now the question is asking us not to give our answers, our answer in meters, but in centimeters. In our channel, we have a video where you convert measurement. So, but I'm going to go quickly through the lesson. You have kilometer, you have meter, centimeter, and millimeter. When you move from kilo to meter, it's 10,000. It's 1,000. One and one zero. From meter to centimeter is 100. From centimeter to millimeter is 10. So in this question, we are asked to move from meter to centimeter. So from meter to centimeter, when I go to the right, I multiply. When I go back, I divide. So I'm, I'm from a this bigger one to a smaller one. I'm going to multiply. So I'm going to have 0, 0,03 meter multiplied by from meter to centimeter. I multiplied by 100. So my answer will be in centimeters. So I take my calculator. 0, 0,03 multiplied by 100. Then my answer is 3 centimeters so it means in the map this 600 meter will be this equal to three centimeters in our map okay let's look at the next example okay. this is our, our second example that we are given the scale on a map is one centimeter to 775 kilometers what does a distance of six millimeters on the map represent on the ground now the problem is that your scale is one centimeter to 750 kilometers but you are given six millimeters so your first step is to convert the millimeters to centimeters what do i have i have six millimeters they must give me centimeters now, you remember this thing, 
when from kilometer to meter multiplied by 100 meter to centi thousand hundred and then ten but now we are moving from millimeter we are given millimeter and we want centimeter so we are going back when we're going back we're going to divide divide with a what with a 10 so here i will say divide by 10 and then this is something that you need to memorize. This scale, you memorize it, it will help you a lot in an exam. 6 divided by 10. And then our answer is 0, 0,6. So 6 millimeters is the same as 0, 0,6 centimeters. Now we're going to, let's use our scale and convert it. Our scale is 1 centimeter is 275 kilometers. So, what does a distance of 6 centimeters on the map, on the map, what this we are given, it's on the map, represent on the ground. So, we are moving from the map to the ground. So, you're going to multiply. You're going to have 0, 0,6 on the map multiplied by 75. We multiply to get what we have on the ground. So 0, 0,6 multiplied by 75. So... On the ground is 75 kilometers. Okay. Um, this is how you do it. This is 75 kilometers. Just remember that when we are given on the map going to the ground, you multiply. When we are given the ground going to the map, you divide with a what? With a scale that we are, we are given. Um, thank you for watching. This is the end of our lesson. Mm-hmm.